okay to find the app mobile data toggle in the Google Play Store. You just search for mobile data toggle as done here, or you could also search for do not consulting and I'll bring up all my apps. So once you see it in the store, and I'll also have a uh, link in the description of this video. But this is a look at the app in the Google Play Store, it gives some screenshots, it gives a description of what the app does. And what it basically does is add a mobile data toggle to the notification drop down on your Android phone. This is the Galaxy S5. So when you open up the app in the Google Play Store, you install it. And once it's installed, go to your app drawer and find it. And click on it once. And then the next time you turn off your display and bring it back up, you'll see it come up in the upper left corner there. And I can see it here. And right now it shows that the data mobile data is off, so that's why it says data toggle off. And to turn it back on, you hit the button below it. And then now it indicates that the data mobile data is on. And you can all see it up in the upper left corner there. And it'll always be there in the background. And you turn your phone off and on, it'll come back up. And just any time you want to toggle between having your mobile data on and off, just come up here and if it's on, you toggle it off. And if it's off, you can toggle it back on. So that's quick overview of the app. It's pretty simple, pretty straightforward, and that does add some nice functionality missing, especially from the Galaxy S3 and the Galaxy S5. Okay, if you go to your notifications and happen to see that the button for enabling or disabling isn't being shown, that's a uh, feature in newer versions of Android where it'll take permanent notifications and collapse them if they haven't been used in a while. Basically two ways to uh, Take care of this problem if you just swipe down. You can see that then the toggle data on button is there. Which you then click on and toggle it on and off. Or if you don't want to do that, if your screen goes off and you enable your screen again, it'll pop up and then that button will be shown below the notification so you can click on it. There are two basic versions of mobile data toggle. There's a free version and a paid version, which is 99 cents. The main difference is that with the free version, it is fully functional, but only Monday through Thursday. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, the notification interface will be disabled, so you won't be able to toggle your data on and off. And by default, when it switches over to this, it will toggle your data on so that you can manually do that if you want. But the paid version is fully functional always, seven days a week, 24 hours a day. And again, it is uh, 99 cents and gives you this added functionality. The free version is basically designed to let you test the app to make sure it works with your phone.